importing realistic car controller to the project. Open the package manager from window package manager. Search for realistic car controller under my assets directory. Install all dependencies. It will restart the Unity after installing the input system if you're not using Unity 6. After the restart, import the asset again. Installer will add necessary tags and layers to your project settings. After the successful import, Welcome window will appear. Import Text Mesh Pro Essentials. Here you can test all the demo scenes. Be sure to have the demo scenes in your build settings. Let's have a look at the general shared settings called RC settings. Here, you can tweak the shared settings have been used by the asset easily. Ready to use behavior presets. Inputs. Enabling, disabling the mobile controllers, changing the mobile controller type. Variable ground physics. When the ground physics material matches, corresponding changes will be made. AI vehicle in the demo scene is using regular vehicle controller script. Additionally, it has AI controller script attached to the root.
Let's create a new vehicle from scratch under a few seconds. Drag and drop your vehicle model to the scene. Be sure your model's pivot position and axis orientation is correct. Always use pivot and local editor modes while checking them. Select the root gaming object of the vehicle and open the setup wizard. Unpack the prefab and disconnect the link to the model. Wizard will ask you to fix the pivot position. Choose yes if your model doesn't have it properly. At this step, we're going to select front wheel models and rear wheel models if it can't find them, you can assign the wheel models manually. All rigid body gaming objects must have proper colliders with accurate shape. Select the main body part of the vehicle and add mesh collider to it. Now we've a controllable vehicle under just 60 seconds. It using default settings and configuration, let's start by creating lights, cameras, exhausts. In scene, buttons are useful to create them easily. Once we select the vehicle in the scene, we can use the panel easily. Let's have a look how the vehicles work. Each vehicle has RC Car Controller 4 script attached to the root. The script controls and manages everything belongs to the vehicle of them have been categorized.
customizer system can be installed to the vehicle and used. Add the customizer to the root of the vehicle to use it. It has subsystems for each type, such as spoilers, painters, neon, etc. Here we can select the engine sounds and edit their parameters easily. The vehicle is using default settings on damage. The wheels have been deformed inaccurately on this Collison. Let's have a look how the damage system works. Disable auto install option and select which parts of the vehicle should be damaged. Once we disable the option, a few buttons in our inspector panel will show up. We're going to exclude non-deformable parts now. 